Hey guys, this is Miyaka from Miyaka618, also known as Miyaka's Creations, and I'm going to do a quick tutorial for you to uh, how to use the texture panel here on IMVU Studio to quickly change the color for any product in the catalog uh, and then resubmit it as your own. So for this particular demonstration, I am going to use these holiday heels made by Nurse Assistic. Um, in order to start a new product, you hit the little plus button over here, and um, you can take anything that is on this list. These are all derivable, but for this particular demonstration, I have already found a product, so I'm putting in the PID that I found in the catalog. So to do that, make sure I click on PID, do a quick search, um, and then you can see it is the bottom of the derived chain, so I don't have to go any farther, and hit cl uh, click derive. And as you see, there they are again. All right, so we are gonna just change these to black. And this will take less than five minutes, I guarantee it. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're going to take the, the textures here. So you go to the diffuse panel, you can see the textures. This is the material tab. You'll take the textures, you're gonna click over the three dots and you're gonna filter the texture colors. So I'm just going to reduce the saturation for both of these to negative 100. And then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add a black texture to the uh, project textures here. By doing this, I'm going to hit the little plus button, add a color texture, and then I can just pick whatever color I want. I'm just going to do black for this one. Add color texture, but I don't want to keep that as my texture, so I'm going to click back onto the original texture. I'm going to go back over to the three dots and I'm going to combine textures. So this is the texture that's currently there. I'm going to find the black that I just made and I'm going to stretch it out. I like doing this a few times, it's just easier. It covers the whole thing and then reduce the opacity down to 0.85 and apply. And I'm going to do the same thing with this texture. Um, I don't have to make another black one because the black one was already created, so it's already there. Stretch it out, reduce it to 0.85, so you can still kind of see the um, the texture from the previous uh, texture map. Hit apply, and then I'm gonna hit preview, and now we have black heels. Um, I left the little fuzz balls here. Uh, I'm also going to do one last step. I'm going to add a little bit of shininess, and I don't want it to be overpowering, so I'm going to go over to the shininess map, um, hit the little plus button. I'm again going to hit this plus and add another color texture. Um, the, the wider the uh, um, color texture you pick, the shinier is going to be. I want to do something in the middle. I'm just going to add that. I'm going to go to the bows and then add that color I just made there. And I'm going to preview it. And now they have a slight glean. And that is it. That is all you have to do to do a solid color change for any product in the catalog. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Now jump right in and start making your own products. Thank you. Um, if you would like to hear more tutorials like this, I will be doing more small, short tutorials about different parts of the uh, iView Studio to make it easier to to start making your own products. Um, if you have any tutorial requests, feel free to comment below. Uh, thank you guys.